What's up guys, uh, welcome back. This is my boy Gia Adam Slink. How are you guys doing? Welcome to another crazy video. Uh, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you are watching this video from. Well guys, uh, let's have a discussion concerning the Nigeria politics and uh, there are many updates on the Peter Obi's uh, running mate and uh, Wiki allegedly joining APC and uh, Tinubu is already sharing phones for his campaign and set. And uh, also as well, we're going to talk about an update on E.K. Kwerimadu's case. Well, there's a really big update, guys. But the most important one now, the current one, is Peter Obi running mate. And is none other than Dr. Yusu Dante Hamed. That may possibly be next Nigeria vice president. And by the special grace of God to his supporters and uh, people supporting Peter Obi, by the special grace of God, he might be the next. And uh, we have heard a lot of things about him. People are saying it's a really fine choice. After all, Kwan Kwasu, who said he, he has all it takes, you know, he's not coming forth. And he wants to be the president and Peter Obi being the vice president. And at the end of the day, they end up indirectly insulting each other, Peter Obi and Kwan Kwasu insulting each other and that they have parted where however see we move i think labor party just told themselves you know what we cannot be doing all those things let us they are trying to do us delay tactics they will make us look as if we do not know what we are doing so let us announce uh, this man as a vp and then let's move ahead and continue with the campaign and let us really meet the people so i'm really really happy they have already chosen and uh, we are waiting for uh, APC to pick a running mate. APC already picked the running mate, but they are still contemplating. And uh, PDP as well, <laughs> Okowa is the running mate for Atiku, but they are still kind of like really checking if they should reconsider Wiki. And the Wiki is not coming forth. Well, let, us give, let me give you a little biography of uh, Dante Hamed or Yusufu. Yusuf is... Uh, he said he's an economist. He's a senator and founder of Bayes University Abuja and Baba Hamed University Kano. He is also the founder of Bayes University Hospital, rumored to be the biggest private hospital in Africa. He is the next VP of Nigeria 2023. Then let me just read some few comments coming from people concerning uh, Dante. And Rinomokore said, Dr. Dante is an excellent VP choice. If the news is true, highly caribbean, accomplished from an early age, we welcome him into the race to Asso Rock and hope he is inclusive to the ticket we energize the youth. As especially as he is an inventor in education. There, well, I'm reading some few comments, guys. From uh, That is coming from uh, Reno or Mockery. He said that uh, Dante is a really fine choice. And uh, Dr. Filili said, the VP Dante Yusuf will never interfere with employment process at Bayes University. As a former assistant professor there, I can tell you, is the only private university where all tribes are well represented. The immediate past DVC was an Igbo man. Thank you, Labour. Then uh, another, this lady said, Peter Obi and Yusuf, how do they look? Don't you like the confidence and awesomeness oozing from both? Nigeria is about to experience real and drastic change in all sectors especially in international image and national rebranding. Well, I just hope those people who are blazing uh, good talks, you know, hyping them. I just hope their dreams actually come true because they are perfect. Honestly, they are perfect, well-educated know exactly what they are what they are doing they have established in different sector they have established in different sectors so it's a really fine choice guys it's a really fine choice unlike apc 
well <laughs> i don't want to throw jab at all well let's see what apc and pdp will do because this they still have a really fine choice as well you know it just depends on who you want to vote for man <laughs> you understand I, I i can't be saying i like this more than this but uh, i've already made my choice known for those of you who have been watching me so i'm not going to repeat it again so go and get your pvc and make sure you vote for whoever you want to vote for and then uh, let me uh, read what come great dg wrote he said if it's true that Dante Baba Ahmed is OBVP, then I am sure this is a social media presidency. The ticket, remain, the ticket reminds me of Shio Sani, who has 2.6 million followers on Twitter, but scored two votes at PDP Palmares. Of all the jobless former governor in the, in the North, Obi couldn't find any. All the jobless governor in the North, Obi couldn't find any. See, Cumbria then, oh, I, I truly respect, I truly respect this man, but the way they talk, eh, he doesn't believe, well, well, let me not just talk about him. I, well, all those activists then, this time they are showing their true color. All those activists that have been in Nigeria agitating and all the rest. Just check them, just look watch the way they are talking. They are showing their true color. It's all about politics to them. It's politics. Well, let's uh, move forward, guys. Uh, let's talk about Wiki. There are these videos circulating online that shows Wiki speaking about the campaign to APC. When I listen to it, I say that Wiki they talk. Well, listen to it, guys. What are we talking about? What are we talking about? I've told everybody who cares. What makes you a man is to be able to tell your people the simple truth. I'm leaving PDP today to APC because one, PDP has not done anything for the South South. Honestly speaking, I think this is an old video. So someone bringing it out now, I don't know, but honestly, just check wiki face now very yeah don't relax and all the rest so <laughs> i do not think so man this is an old video so wiki is not departing to well, i do not think it's departing anywhere and meanwhile they even uh, shut down the rumor they said according to daily trust river state governor nelson wiki has debuted the claim that he has defected from the people democratic party to the ruling to the ruling Hall Progressive Congress, APC. Well, and I'm not sure he's going to do that anytime soon because Wiki said he's a party person. But supporting article is something I do not know because according to Wiki said, according to people close, rumor, Wiki said, you people do not want me in the seat, but you people want reverse money. Abby, stay there, they wait for reverse money. They do election <laughs> well and uh Bolatunubu is sharing phone and they check out this recent phone that was uh that was uh someone posted it online and uh, it shows how cost how they customize the phone to be showing the uh, Bolatunubu's face and all the rest just imagine going around and sharing these phones to to our mothers, <laughs> their head goes scatter after everybody needs phones. Yeah? See, oh, when you home put on the phone, it was just you, Bola, Tunubu, democracy, and all the talking, talking, and all the things, all the rest. Okay, whoever is doing this, continue now. Well, <sighs> the election, eh? people will chop money, shall. Then let's talk about E.K. Kuremadus. Well, here's the headline. It said, alleged organ investing the E.K. Kuremadus to remain in jail till August 4. Victim makes a U-turn, says he is 21 years old. <laughs> well, the guy who told the uh, U.K. Uh, authorities that he, he was 15 years old, now he has made a U-turn. He said he's not 21 years old. 
That is number one thing, lying to the government. The case has been postponed to August. Lying to the government is one thing. And because you lied, because you lied, I bet you this guy will definitely be deported. You lied. We definitely, that is number one thing. You do not lie. You do not lie. I don't know how you guys will take it. For those of you who are abroad, or especially in UK, do you think this guy lying, the UK government will still consider to make him, to allow him to stay in UK and uh, take care of him, like give him an asylum, not allow him to go back to Nigeria? Do you think? He already lied though. He said he was 15. Now he said he's 21 years old. So do you think the UK government would consider him? Please can let us know because I don't want to make any conclusion yet. But thank you guys for watching. It's your boy Gadam Sling. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Catch you next time. Don't go anywhere. Have a wonderful day. Stay blessed. Bye.